My name is Jonathan Parks, and welcome to Jonathan's Nature Craft. I must inform you that I do not live in this house by myself, but live here with other people. Sometimes other members of the household may have to walk through areas where I might be recording with other family members on the phone. If you hear any noise like that, please feel free to disregard. We are doing our best to get noise-canceling equipment, which may at least keep you from hearing exactly what is being said. Thank you for considering. Now, as for this next part of the series, there's probably another little thing or two we're gonna come on to show a little bit here and for <clears throat> the thing that it is I'd like to say that there's something you can do you can use a V gouge to do it but it might depend on the wood depend on how hard it is but I say that I might go ahead and try it here to cut along these lines for the insides of the wings. I say just kind of do little places here where we cut along here and make these little lines come out and have the little cardinal just make its way as a nice little critter when we sort of get all these little places done out of the little figure of a thing and with all we got here there's a little place to go along the wing when we come to the back and put little places right in where we sort of make the lines and the marks and how it all comes down and there's a place down here where we got the little area for that is between the wings in the little back of the cardinal place and how we just kind of like get those little lines done right in there to sort of like you see I started a little slit there and kind of make little ways to cut little lines further along see how little Robin or Cardinal will turn out and for these little places where we put it right in, you see, we kind of got along here and along the other way and put the little place down in here. This will probably be a little bit of a harder challenge because we're kind of getting the wood right in the way and making things seem like they're going to be kind of nice little works that come out of what we have and to come down to it we see that there is just one little thing or two we do come down and make little lines where we just quite like intersect the wings a little bit make that little spot right there and come down to this sort of come into this other line and then remove what's around here this part as well and kind of get a little better focus into the wood itself. I say that these are going to be 
good little lines we make and come down to where we just see what it's going to be like and there's a little more wood to shave along the rest of the way here and remove a little more chips of cherry wood to make it so it's going to be a little better for us in the long run and all that we're going to do I say I say that this is just the time and effort we take into things make things so they're going to be a fine little piece of work to be done when we all get through and see a little place where we removed a little more and when it comes down to just the last little bit of art I say that this is going to be a little kind of thing that makes us all happy inside and give us all the little grace of life that we need to move things along see little happy birds I say this is just one little place where we remove along the wing and I say I say get a little place done in here and this is just a little something that we're going to do when we get down to the last bit of the that gum work and I say I say kind of put little extra pieces in the what all we have and say and do bless a little birdie bless a little animal oh the cardinal can just kind of have a little happy home in your heart and happy home in your place I know one thing for sure that things are going to differ as we move around in this world from one place to the next seeing how birdies shall kind of find a little way make their homes out of little ashes and timbers and I say I say finally come down to where we get all this out got all the wood removed from between the wings and for one thing I say that there cometh a point where we can start coming along the top of the head kind of remove the wood that comes along the crown and kind of narrow it down to a really good point that we're really going to need I say that this is just something that has a way in us to move about us and show us who we are, what we do, all the grace in our hearts. It's just kind of one little way, make a little thing just shine a light in someone else's eyes. Oh, I say brighter images brighter days oh what goodness this has for us blessing children and blessing deeds oh I say God bless the lungs the ones who really work hard and so I say this is a kind of work doesn't all get done overnight it takes its own steps, makes its own ways, and then I say, once you get this far, it should look about like this. Maybe come down 
even to the another place where you kind of remove wood along this other little area to kind of make it so the bird can have a little extra beak and kind of make it so we just see things work out happen for the better and you know it's just kind of like what we all have when we work at what we do places we work hard to be where do the little things I say that I kind of got one little side done it's probably going to take a little more strength and time to get the rest of the face done but as for the little work we kind of get out of our things we got a good place in our minds and hearts where we work at things so good I say I say that this is just the better the better thing we have when we come down to see a little peace in our lives and all the work we have together as a group to all people I say, I say that this is just a joyful ride up the little wood carving area and valley and over the hill we go. I say little Cardinal has a little good way to make itself kind of have oh good graces and all things I say. I'll tell you one thing, you know is just the kind of thing where it just goes along it's just kind of where we work along these lines Make it so cardinals can be the signs of all the state birds we have all around us. So I say beautiful work shall come a long way, I say. Beautiful work shall come the right way, I say. To make it so we see grace in our hearts for what we have or do to make us see happy little faces of good little people and as for the rest of the beak we'll come back and take care of that later but I do want to say that I appreciate your time the time you come on the time you watch the time you give and of all things I say that there's a lot of ways to support the best way to support this business and ministry would be through prayer and and all things go according to God's will. But thank you all for coming on and I wish you all the best always and keep in touch. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to this channel. I hope to see you in the next video. Stay tuned.